We're making sushi. I gave my friend Adam the recipe to make it, but my recipe has been translated through over 60 languages and then back to English. Let's see who makes the better Japanese dish. So let's start with the, the most basic thing here. First step, we are gonna, you know, make the sushi rice. So in a large bowl, use your fingers to wash the rice with cold water until the water is almost clear, changing the water frequently. So now we have the first step of the translated bit right, right. here, right? Um, and so we have in a large bowl, ready to dry your fingers, wash the bowl with cold water until it is shiny and full, four to eight hours. <laughs> There you go. All right, so I got I got a large bowl here. I feel like I'm ready to dry my fingers. But Are yeah, you? I to, well, I need to wash them first, right? Right, so like, right, yeah. right. You gotta get them wet. All right, so let me uh, wash it, go. I guess. Yeah, yeah no, until I mean, it's like shiny and full. And we gotta do this there for, it is. what, it says four to eight four hours? Four to eight hours. Okay. So, yeah. <clears throat> That's crazy, it's been four to eight hours. So the next one. Soak the clean rice, which we have here, okay. in fresh cold water for 30 minutes. Drain rice in a fine mesh sieve. There you go. Look at that. Look right, at yeah, that. Put it down. Awesome. So, uh, meanwhile, you know, while that's soaking for 30 minutes, uh, soak the rice in cold water for 30 minutes and sieve with a fine bag. Now, when it says the rice. Yeah, when it says the rice. Is it um, just all of the leftover rice? So we kind of. Yeah, all right. So I'm just kind of going to. Cold water. On, on the rice. For the sake of time, I think it's been 30 minutes yeah, it's on wow. this <laughs> rice Are we about to here. do another time skip? So we have soaked so the rice. rice. Is fully soaked. And yeah, now we need to sieve it with a fine bag. Where's the fine bag? Do we have a fine bag? That's this a fine a looking fine... bag. <laughs> We're gonna poke holes in the... Is that a knife? Of course it is. Okay, here you go. <laughs> okay. Poke holes in the bottom. Oh yeah. It's draining Yeah, it's, right. like it's draining. There goes the. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You know, so just, what's, what? What is the next step? The in, next in sushi step making? in the Adam recipe: cook the rice on the stove top in an electric rice cooker. We're not that fancy here. With the kombu, <laughs> we're cooking on the stove top. Combine the rice in two cups of water in a medium pot over medium heat. Awesome. Hey, good job. Yeah, we're doing great. Absolutely. We're, cook, it. we're cooking in the in the kitchen here. Let's see how that is somehow translated. Cook in the oven or in the oven. So we're cooking in- Either one. Yeah, either, either one, you know. It could be the oven or the yeah. oven. Uh, boil the batter from the pan over medium heat with two cups of rice water. Yep. Yep, okay. So we need rice water. So let me just kind of, you know, kind of squeeze out the- The leftover- Rice water. Water. Oh, I'm seeing a little, okay. Oh, there is, there is, some, there is some, you know. Surprising amount. There's actually like a, a lot of water. Of water. There's enough, you can kind of see the Yeah, water look at that. There. So we have the two cups of rice water. Yeah, and so we've also prepared some uh, batter. So we're gonna oil that. I, oh, yep. Um, cook in cook oven. in oven or in, or the, in oven. the oven. Well, we, we don't have to use the oven. We could use the oven instead. Yeah, we could use the oven, that's true. And you know what, What's what else is like an oven but a stove? No, you gotta like, yeah, there you go. All right, yeah, so we're gonna now boil the batter rice water. The rice batter <laughs> is indeed cooking. All right, so let's go into the next step. What do, what do you we do should, next? How do you, how do you cook should, sushi? We should probably start looking at a couple of these ahead of time. Because step four is cover and bring to a boil. <laughs> Then reduce the heat to low and cook until the water is completely absorbed. And look, we did it already. It looks the same. Hey, if you like the video, subscribe. I do crazy stuff like this all the time. Like recently, I broke a world record in chemistry. Check it out. All right, so now that you've done that, uh -huh. right? So let me do mine. <laughs> then reduce the heat uh, to 12 minutes. When using a pot of rice, use sushi if possible. <laughs> and add a certain amount of water to three cups of rice. Adam, can you please do me a favor and yeah. reduce the heat to 12 minutes for me? Yep. When you reduce the heat to 12 minutes. <laughs> yes, when you reduce the heat to 12 minutes. You start with oh, you uh, don't know either. Wait. <laughs> this right here. Okay. And then you type in 12 minutes. And then you press start. Perfect. Look at that. All right. Okay. 
Uh, so use sushi if possible, really quick. The irony of us <laughs> cooking sushi and then pulling yeah, you, sushi out of it's the It's crazy fridge. that you have to use sushi <laughs> to, to make cook sushi. sushi yeah, right? something like a lot of people don't know. Yeah, so you, we'll put in a little bit of uh, sushi here. So three cups of rice. Right. There's one. That's, that's two cups of rice. That is three cups of rice. You can't even All right. Sushi anymore. Right, and then add a certain amount of water. Now right. I am very certain about yes. the amount of water. And, that we and what is to what add. is that amount you're certain about? It's, you help? Yeah, no, I'm good. Yeah, it's 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 <laughs> this amount of water. That's exactly that's crazy, exactly this I amount of water. I was just right thinking. Here. So yeah. let me just put that amount of water mm. in. Okay, so. Next up, let's see what you have in store. In a small saucepan, combine the vinegar, sugar, and salt over medium-high heat. Bring to a boil and whisk until the sugar dissolves. So, now that we have that, let's uh, go and do the next step in the translated recipe. In a small pan, bring to a boil, add garlic, sugar and salt yeah that makes sense right you know, small pan um that looks small to me this is this is small that's right? a pretty small this pan. looks really small that's one of the like, smaller I mean, compared that's one to one of the smaller you know, pans I yeah, yeah yeah okay add garlic and then sugar it's sugar nice nice so that's sugar and then add salt nice wait wait <laughs> Get in the car, stirring until the sugar has melted. Bring in our, yeah, our, our bring car. In our, our car. There's a good our vehicle. All right, get in the car. It's going so well. I'm in the car. You know, it's... Okay. All right. All right. It's just two. You know. It's just guys being dudes. Right, I'm getting out. It, that's it's probably, looking, it's that's all melted. salt. That's all salt. Yeah, that's, the, sugar's yeah, the, the sugar's melted. The sh that's yeah, salt. that's just the yeah, salt exactly, that's left yeah. in there. Good to know. Okay, awesome. So now we're going to transfer to the next step of the of real. The real. <laughs> Wet the inside of a large bowl with a damp cloth and transfer the cooked rice to the slightly wet bowl, leaving behind any rice that's stuck to the bottom of the pot. All right, good job, awesome. That, what he just did translated is, place a large bowl of green cloth, put mm -hmm. the beef in a small wet bowl of rice and vinegar at the bottom of the pan. Large bowl? La yeah, we do have a large bowl. Look at this conveniently placed wow. green cloth. Conveniently placed green cloth that we already had. Okay, <laughs> so let me get a small wet bowl, rice, perfect, and, and vinegar. And vinegar. Oh, oh. <laughs> Look, now he looks there we go. now he looks surprised. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> what do we do next? Pour the hot vinegar mixture over the rice. Okay. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and pour this, this mixture over the rice. Pour over hot pizza mixed rice. <laughs> well, it's a good thing we had some pizza ready, all ready to go. Okay, <laughs> let me just make sure <laughs> it's being, it's good to pour. Let me, I have an idea. Oh, let's go. That's great. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, look at it. So let's do the next uh, next step uh, in the process. Pair a small bowl of ice water with a splash of rice vinegar. Ooh, pour ice water and hot rice in a small bowl. So we're gonna take some of the hot rice Some more hot rice. <laughs> okay, next step. Dip your hands into the water and use your damp hands to grab a small ball of sushi rice. Using your hands, form the rice into a rectangle about as long as one slice of fish. Perfect. Look yeah. at that. I mean, yeah, for all sizes. Yeah, it's it's uh, small, large, and just right. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Immerse your hands in water and grab wet hands with small sushi balls. Go, go for would it. You, would you like to hold hands under the sushi water? Oh, uh, <laughs> oh, we're interlocking our fingers. Yes. Grab wet hands. Yeah, good thing that they're the small sushi balls. Oh, I can't even, I could not scrub enough right now. Awesome. I'm gonna bathe yeah, my hand in Purell. Okay, nice. Use your arms alone to create a square that is the length of a piece of fish. 
with, with my arms. With ju only, or just your arms. The thing that they don't tell you is, <laughs> What piece of fish? Right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like a piece of fish, is very, very arbitrary. Okay. So really, this is this is a, what a fresh piece of uh, swordfish is often cut into to pieces of this. Length. Yeah, I'm making. So you're making regular sushi. Yes. I'm making swordfish exotic. As yeah, one would exotic say. sushi. Using a chopstick, place a small dab of wasabi paste on the center of the rice. All right. Yeah, wasabi paste. Oh, nice. Small dab. That is a very small dab. Okay, nice. Small dab of wasabi Small on dab the rice. Small dab of wasabi on the rice. Um, okay, um, well next. Using a stick, put a little mustard puree in the middle of the rice. So mine, right? Uh, so we have a stick. What if we just dip the stick into the mustard? Mustard puree, really kind of. There it is. Kind of twirl scoop, it around. Scoop it up a bit. Yeah. Oh yeah, get a. There it yeah, is. We're gonna put it right in the the rice. Right in the center. Right, right in the. Right in the middle. Oh, uh, that's why they make you use a stick, right? So then it can. So you can get. Yeah, yeah. yeah so you can just like have make it. sure it stays. Yeah. That's make gonna sure stab stay. my eyeball. <laughs> oh, oh, is that why they kind of have you? You know, kind of. <laughs> Perfect, awesome. Okay, cool. Right. Let's get to the step very here. last step um, of the sushi making process. Pop the rice ball with a slice of fish and gently squeeze the rice and fish together in one hand using the index finger of your other hand to keep the fish in place. Well, that is that is the completed sushi, but let's finally complete the Google translated part. Gently rub the batter with pieces of fish, add the rice and fish with one hand and rub the fish with your fingers. So I'll, I'll cut up a piece of fish really quick. Yeah, so I'm gonna- Rub that batter. Rub the batter. Add okay. some rice. Yeah, add some rice. Yeah, there it is. Nice. And nice, then add the adding, fish. adding the rice, add the fish with one and hand, and then we gotta rub the fish- With your fingers. With my fingers. Look at wow. that. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is a completed piece of sushi. Yeah, okay, okay, so comparing the two, Tasty. Oh my god. Beautiful. Absolutely. I think it's appropriate that I try of course. what you have right. done here. This one's not as here. thick. Who's taking that? And then those are the other chopsticks there. Alright, wait, wait, three, it smells so two, bad. one! Mmm. 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 Oh. I did a perfect <laughs> job! It's so good! Cheers. Cheers. It's a good sushi Chef. making. <laughs> it's a good sushi making.